If you forgot to track a workout but still want to close your rings, here's how you can manually add workout data on Apple Fitness. If you're like me and go to the fitness app looking for a way to manually input workouts, that's not going to work. Not sure why Apple did it this way, but to input workouts manually, you have to do it through the Health app. Once you're in the Health app, you'll need to find your workouts data. I have mine saved here on the top in my favorites, but if you don't have it here, just tap Show All Health Data and scroll down until you see Workouts. There it is. Now you can add data and input your workout details. This part is a little tricky, because if you didn't record your workout, you won't know exactly how many calories you burned or how much distance you covered. If I didn't record a workout, I usually try to look at how long I was working out, and then based on my past workouts, I'll just throw my best estimate for the calories burned. All right, I'll pretend I played handball and burned maybe something like 500 calories. And now that I look at this, I don't think handball would really have mileage, would it? Something Apple needs to double check. Let's change the sport to something else. Hockey is pretty cool, so we'll go with that. 500 calories again, not sure if that's accurate or not, but we'll go with it for the demonstration here. And I'll mark this as a one hour workout. All done. Then we'll add this, and the health app will create a hockey workout that was worth 60 exercise minutes and 500 calories burned. You'll now see the workout in your health app. And if you go back to the fitness app and give it a second to refresh, your rings and workout history will update with your manually input workout. So there you have it. This is a handy little trick to keep your workouts updated if you didn't wear your Apple Watch or forgot to record a workout. Or like in my case, sometimes I take my watch off during high intensity sports where I'm afraid it might get damaged. So this has been a good way to count those workouts in my fitness app, even when I didn't wear my watch. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe for more quick tutorials like this.